Hello, welcome to my class. Back training with kettlebells. Let's start right away with the warm up. Choose light kettlebell if you have variation. Soft knees, chest lifted, belly tight. Start to bring the kettlebell around, around the body, around the world. Check here now that you are not swinging. Inhale and exhale. Let's do five minutes warm up. We start to slowly activate the back muscles. And then we start the actual back training. Check here really that you are now having good posture, shoulders down, core activated. Change the direction. Now continue the same exercise. Check that if this is working out with other foot high up, not so high up, but a little bit high up, change the direction, lift your foot off from the ground, a little bit checking the balance. Now the core has to really work, activate your belly. If you're a beginner, you can as well continue the first exercise. Let's change the direction and lift the other leg up. Okay, I am starting to sweat. <laughs> Great. Then, a little bit soft knees. Bend your hips and start to bring the kettlebell between your legs. Think about it's number eight. Check here that you are not rounding your back. Your back is straight. Inhale and exhale. Change the direction. Here you feel already that the back is starting to work. up, lift your leg up and bring the kettlebell uh, leg slowly down, keep here now as well, good posture. Last ones, great. Then goblet grip. And start to bring the kettlebell around your head. Hello, hello, hello. Now check that you are not swinging from your hips, that you are keeping your core tight. My hair is bringing a little bit extra challenge. <laughs> And change the direction, really warming up the upper back as well. I should thought of my, <laughs> my hair before this <laughs> workout. Great. 
shake, little shake, and push it a little bit up and down, up and down. A little bit soft knees. Great. You can put the kettlebell down a little bit. Shake your shoulders. We are ready to start our first exercise. We are doing swinging, one arm swinging. Now I go a little bit heavier. I go a few kilos heavier. One pound heavier. <laughs> and I show you quickly. So we are going try from the hip, hips and we do 45 seconds each side, then we go to left, right, left, two rounds. Back safety, core is working. Are you ready? So, time is starting, 10 seconds. Here we don't have breaks, so now it is quite tough, tough minutes. Three, two, one, let's go. And here, squeeze your butt as well. Here are the lats. You feel here your now our back is working a little bit more than when doing the swing with the two hands. Of course, your back is working and uh, even the glutes are working. And we switch. first round full then we continue right away the second round and then we have a break and switch now work with your core keep your belly tight Keep your upper back activated, don't round your back. And break, great job. Shake your arms, always check that your posture as well is good. If you have water, you can drink a little bit of water. When you have a break, I'll show you the next exercise. We are doing American swings. So, we are going all the way up. So, try it from your pelvis. So, we go all the way up. If I have space, I can show you this way as well. 
here, lock your shoulders, when you go up, lock your shoulders, chest, we are doing three rounds, one minute, and we have 45 seconds break between, now I go a little bit heavier, I can as well vary between the rounds. Extremely important back safety. Keep your core work. Try from your pelvis. 10 seconds. Are you ready? And these are then the last swings. Three more sets of swings and we are done. Time is starting now. Squeeze your glutes as well. Squeeze your butt. more like this is a fat burn program <laughs> but great great exercises for the for the back I promise why I feel that this break is going much more than the actual time when we are exercising <laughs> 10 seconds I will keep my weight same it was enough for me today Five seconds. Are you ready? One minute is starting. Time is starting now. Remember always when you lift the kettlebells, the core is activated and back is right. One minute is long, right? It is much more longer than 45 seconds. We actually do the exercises. <laughs> news we are already halfway and after this we have one more set of swings then we are doing more concentrating more of rep and really doing pure strength strength but keep your technique together when you, if you're getting tired, time. Always check that even if you're getting tired, your technique is still all right. The powerhouse is, powerhouse is working. <laughs> Take a sip of water. I say 10. Are you ready? Last round. Three seconds. Time is starting now. Now let's just decide. Time will fly. Concentrate on your technique. Oh, not 
much anymore. Not much anymore. 20 seconds. 15. 10. Everything is easier as it is. <laughs> Great. Shake it up. And next, we are doing sumo deadlifts. I'm gonna go a little bit higher with my weight. But we are combining that with the rowing. I'm gonna show you. So, with the sumos, I'm going pretty high. So, quite wide position now with your legs. Check that the knee and foot is going same direction. Try to keep the weight more on your heels more back. This is at least how I get better feeling. So the sumo, I'm just gonna show you. I can still have a little break. So we go down and then we come up. I'll show you this way. Bend your pelvis. Check here. Just this shouldn't happen. Most important here is that you are not bending your back. Up and down. Arching your back. Neutral position. And then we do that. 15 times for this round, and then we take lighter weight. This, I tell you, 12 to 15 reps, depending on your weight. And we do rowing. Are you ready? Let's start. First the sumos, and then the rowing. Let's go, my friend. Let's go, my friend. Don't round your back. Check that your weight is not on your toes. Keep your belly tight. Here. Well, a little bit squeeze your glutes extra. <laughs> Great. Rolling time. Three. I do compromise. I do 12, 6, 7, 8, 9. Can resist when going down, getting harder. 10, 11, 12. We are doing here super set with the sumos. 1, 2, Little break, and then we start with the 
Optimus again. Who is sweating? I am sweating. Fifteen times. Look at my towel. Disgusting. Um. Keep your back straight. Are you ready? Fifteen times. was 15. Great. Rowing. If you had too lightweight, go higher or other way around. If you had too hard, too heavy weight, go lighter. Techniques would be good. Technique first. Are you ready? 12 to 15, 10 to 15, depending on your weight. Resist. Make your core work. <laughs> I have to laugh at myself because I am so serious. <laughs> That's a serious workout. Other way around. No results. Big smiling. 12 times. Fitness is such a serious thing. Halfway. Seriously, regretting that I forgot my towel. I don't remember. Today's first hot days here in Vienna. My exercise room is getting hot. Cool. We move on. Our next exercise is targeting more the upper back. I am taking this kettlebell. I'm gonna show you. We do circles, front, and we change the direction. Now, this I don't wanna see that you do. This is not targeting the upper body, <laughs> this is dancing. So, isolate the movement and don't go too low because that as well gives too much rest for your our back, what should be our target. We are doing that 45 seconds. Then we do what we did as well, our warm up. So we lift the kettlebell up just 10 times without time. Two rounds. Are you ready? Ten seconds and we are starting. Shoulders down. Three, two, one. Keep your core tight. Calm movement, but really, this shouldn't happen. I see you. So freeze your lower body, but make your core work.
killing me softly and slowly. Great. Ten times. One. Slowly down. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Break. Nice. Very good combination, I must say. Next round. I have to go two kilos with one pound lighter. Two kilos or one pound lighter as that was tough. Ooh. 20 seconds and we start again. This is the last exercise, my friend. Then we are done. Then we do a little nice short cool down. Five seconds. Same thing. Here we go. I'm happy that I went lighter. I would die. The heavier one because I'm dying already now. Great. Ten times. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Fighting time, don't go too low. Eight, nine, ten. Great job. Great job. Shake it. Shake it. Circles. Arm oh, circles. Hey, great job! Both direction. Let's do a little, little cool down stretch for the arms. Back. your arms and roll down. You can lock your knees, relax your neck. Or if that's it if, if it or if it feels too much you can as well have your knees soft. Relax your arms. Cross your arms and rotate side by side. Stay on your left side. Relax your neck. You can rotate as much as you want, you feel here. Well, your upper back, relax your neck. Maybe you feel even a little bit your lower back. Let's 
stay in the middle and you can bring your hands behind your knees and lift yourself up. Pull yourself up. Feel nice stretch there between your shoulder blades. And rotate to the other side. Your right side. Back in the middle. So please and roll up. Bring your arms together. Push your shoulders down and lift your elbows up. behind your back and now you can bring the whole package to the other side and bring your head to the right side you feel a nice stretch in your neck Pull it too hard. Other side. Change the grip. and bring your arms front and do easy rotation round your back, round your upper back. And relax. Great, great job. Great training for the back. I say thank you for joining my class. Don't forget to subscribe our channel if you haven't done it so far. And if you would like to know more about our online fitness coaching programs, go and visit our home base to fitnesslovers.com. Or if you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact me. Great that you joined me today. Have a lovely day. Bye bye.